Hi there. I just wanted to do a quick um, video here. I'm just currently making a uh, blog in Drop Funnels on how I create um, or how I generate leads using Drop Funnels. Um, so essentially, I'm creating a blog right now, um, and I I wasn't planning on doing any recording, but um, I just wanted to show you guys uh, how many um, services are connected in the um, the opt-in uh, forms. Um, I know a lot of people use Active Campaign, but it's it's a bit expensive. Um, I personally was using um, Aweber, um, but um, actually don't use anything now just because um, I found out the Drop Funnels kind of has their own lead. Um, uh, what is it called? Um, they have their own little spot for all the leads. Um, if we go to funnels, uh, there is a place called uh, sales and leads. And um, so essentially, I personally like to do a lot of my own um, uh, follow ups uh, for my leads. But um, if you wanted to set it up automatically, you could um, set up a Weber, you could set up um, maybe a Zapier uh, a connection, um, active campaign, uh, get response. Uh, I actually know a couple other companies um, who I work with uh, at a farmer's market because I also sell coffee and you might see some of the coffee stuff behind me, but um yeah, I run a plumbing company full time and my coffee is part time. But um, yeah, one of the guys at the uh, market, uh, he uses GetResponse. And so if he was to use Drop Funnels to do the rest of his um, uh, his funnels and websites and all that kind of stuff, uh, he could he could tie it into GetResponse, um, Mailchimp, obviously. HubSpot. So like there's so many different services that are already kind of integrated within um, uh, drop funnels that, um, uh, that you can kind of capture some automated uh, lead responses or, or pipelines. Um, so I just thought I'd make a quick video about that today. Um, I was just kind of uh, creating this. I, I made a, um, a YouTube video uh, earlier. So um maybe i'll just kind of leave you here for a moment and i'll i'll kind of finish off this um this page um, i'm just kind of leaving it fairly simple it's just a blank kind of white white blog page um and uh, uh anyway so i'm just saying want more information And then uh, I will uh, okay, look, information. So I'll save that, and then um, you'll put a little row above here, and we'll put another heading in there. <clears throat> Not sure if my computer's being slow today or what, but um, uh, then I'll, maybe I'll just change this opt-in form for a sec. Uh, so I wanted to change the button. That's just going to say um, Um, and maybe we'll do a button icon and we will do like an airplane or something. So 
and or maybe like information or something. Um, how about that? Okay, save. And we'll save draft. Okay, so want more information, name, send, uh, drop funnels. Rows. Little column module and we'll just say sign up for more information. Okay, um, now I will publish, and my little blog is done. Um, it's just super simple. Um, we got my link there if you want to sign up, and then my video, and then in the description of the video is my other little link. So that's that's all done. Uh, it sounds like uh, dinner's basically ready, so I better get off here. Uh, thanks again for watching.